Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Electron TV. For today's knowledge sharing video guys, is about ICCP alarm. And ICCP guys means Impress Current Cathodic Protection. And uh, most of the ships guys have this kind of uh, protection. Because this ICCP guys is protect the ship's body or hull from uh, corrosion also this uh, shot and uh, propeller that's why this is a uh, very important and that's the simplest way guys to explain this kind of system or the ICCP and before we start guys if you are new in my uh, youtube channel it will be a pleasure to me guys if you click like and subscribe to my uh, YouTube channel. And uh, shout out to Shuttle Marine Electromechanical Training Center. And for those who want to learn deep knowledge about ships repair, guys I recommend this training center, Shuttle Marine Electromechanical Training Center. And to Sir Mike, instructor of Shuttle Marine, thank you sir for helping me to solve some of my trouble here in the ship. Okay guys, now here is the ICCP panel. Okay, ICCP. Now guys, look, we have a uh, alarm. The alarm is global 07 or SO1. Now I try to press acknowledge cannot acknowledge the alarm guys we need to fix this alarm first okay the alarm guys here alarm codes 07 means shop grounding alarm assembly might be dirty not installed correctly or brushes might be worn clean in reinstall or change brushes so that's what we need guys to fix the problem and now guys, I just uh, show you this is the form for the ICCP and uh, every day you need to take the record or readings for the ICCP. Here in my ship is uh, you need to take the record of this every day. Here you see guys we have a uh, starboard and port side we have on and off pot okay pot port side on port side off pot starboard off starboard on so just take the record what you see here in this monitor and also guys we have uh, millivolts and milliamps reading and you can see here guys the alarm this ICCP guys if they have alarm they give signal to the ECR okay now guys we are here in the gearbox port side main engine and the main engine is stopped and we are in the anchorage area and that's the good timing to fix this kind of trouble because main engine is not running okay guys now here is the propeller shop and here guys the position or the location of the ICCP shop grounding look guys we have a uh, port and starboard and this is the for the shop rpm so this is the speed sensor guys we have two speed sensor to monitor the rotation or the revolution of this propeller shop okay now guys here 
you need to check the carbon brush okay now guys look this is the carbon brush holder okay look guys the carbon brush is uh, is too small that's why i think that's the reason did not give a good grounding connection so they give a alarm and now guys i try to remove and check the length of this uh, carbon brush we need to take a photo make a dpk report because now guys we don't have spare parts carbon brush and i need to make a spare requisition for this carbon brush look guys the carbon brush is not in good position to remove the carbon brush look guys it's too small you need to replace this one and we have two up and down down it's look a little bit uh, longer than the other and uh, it's my first time to remove this kind of carbon brush in the grounding shop that's why uh, I don't know the length of brand new carbon brush but I think this one is not good it's not enough to make a good contact Okay, now we go to other side. Now guys, I already removed both. It's the same size. It's too small. And look the shape. It's not the same. Down it's uh, good. Up it's uh, small. Okay, now guys, I need to clean this because based in the alarm codes you need to clean this contact for the carbon brush I think I need some uh, fine sandpaper and electro cleaner for better cleaning and now guys I already cleaned this contacts for carbon brush and I put back the carbon brush and look guys the carbon brush it's moving so it's not really good position because the carbon brush holder the lock look the lock they cannot push more the carbon brush that's why I think I need to make something 
to fix that problem because I don't have my spare parts on board and also the other side it's the same I cannot push more that's why sometimes I think the contact was uh, loose mostly here look the down part it's not good and I need to do something to make it better okay and now guys look I already find the remedy how to fix this problem this carbon brush holder I push forward therefore the clip for the carbon brush push a little bit more so I can hold the brush and not moving also here in the other side I push forward now look the carbon brush have a good contact and uh, what I did guys if you see these uh, two bolts here in the middle I just uh, loosened the two bolt and push forward the carbon brush holder and now have a good contact look and for the meantime guys I think for now it's good because there's no spare okay so we go to the other side starboard side now I'm finished here okay guys now I'm here in the starboard shop propeller and this is the gear for the speed sensor and that color green guys is the intermediate shop bearing and that's the starboard gearbox and starboard main engine okay here guys the shop grounding connection and now guys here look it's uh, the same like port side it was small but I think it's have a good contact unlike the port side and this carbon brush holder a little bit uh, forward but look guys this line for the carbon brush contact not uh, wide unlike the port side I think because this one is a good contact but uh, uh, no look down it's moving so I think this one is not good we need to push the carbon brush holder forward we do the same I remove and take photos for the report and spare requisition easy to remove look I think it's uh, small the other side okay all is the same size but the shape is better unlike the port side that's why I think this one is uh, in a good contact okay what 
what I need to do just uh, make photo and put back in a good position and do the same like the port side and clean this to make a better and good contact for the carbon brush and now guys it's already clean and put back the carbon brush in good position look have a good contact now and that's uh, moving And also here, I just push the carbon brush holder a little bit. Okay. Now look, it's good. Okay. Not moving. Also this. And now guys, I'm done. And let's go to check the ICCP panel. If the alarm has already acknowledged or done. Okay now guys, here the ICCP panel. Look, have a check. Sign. And I think it's good. See the alarm already gun and now it's normal there's no alarm that's it finish for today guys and, and again guys don't forget to click like if you like my video and also subscribe to my youtube channel and also the notification bell therefore you're always notified every time i have a knowledge sharing video to all of my subscribers, thank you for watching and see you again in my next knowledge sharing video. Take care always guys. God bless.